you are childless, yet have no love for children. Nigerian Senator Adam Soshomele mocks a dual governor or basic wife. <laughs> now, wow. So, Nana, they believe this talk when they talk, say, not be best in the age, they make them be say guesses. Mm -mm. You feel be 70 years and they not get sense. And 15 years old child, they talk sensible than you. You know, I said this politics, eh? I don't understand. Politicians, some of them will just they talk anyhow because of politics. Politics will make you say what you are not supposed to say. Why mocking a woman without a child? For goodness sake, no woman is happy to be called Barry. May God help those that are seeking for the fruit of the womb today. And, and those, when they mock them, then go shame last, last. This will not be talk. When person like this, grandpapa, feel they talk at format. Because they don't even know what is going to be for your children. You don't buy your own. Glory be to God. What about your children? They never leave finish. So life, they go like this. So why mocking people? Welcome back to Prospect Channel TV. Thank you for always stopping by. If you're just joining us, I beg, subscribe to this channel. Don't forget to give us a thumbs up. I beg, share this video, make it go viral. Share, make it go viral. Make, we expose all these people, all these politicians, eh? Because all this kind of talk, eh? Now, desperation, they call some. The, you people should understand that they are not fighting for you. Mm -mm. It's not because for you. It, it's, not, it's not for you. It's not for you. All these politicians, when you, they see, they go walk by anybody, anything, do anything to make sure they get there. Not be for your sake. Now, personal interests, all these things are selfish interests. You understand? Selfish politics, now they play for Nigeria. A former governor of Edo State to Adam Sushumwale says his successor, Godwin Obaseki and his wife, uh, 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 Bessie Obaseki, are childless. Hmm. The Edo North senator disclosed this in a video uploaded by television uh, Continental TVC on his ex handle on Sunday. He claimed to be reacting to a statement made by the wife of the Edo State Governor, Hubaseke, in which she allegedly claimed that the All Progressive Congress APC governorship candidate in the state, okay, Monday, uh, does not have a wife. In the video, Oshomole said, the governor and his wife refused to adopt any child because they do not love children. I was shocked yesterday to see Mrs. Obasiki, the first lady, saying that our candidate has no wife. She is the most, I am sorry, that she has to say that because here is a woman who has no child. Between him and Obasiki, they have no child. They are childless, he said. They are even not ready to adopt, I mean, I don't blame anybody should not have a child. But people who have love for children, they go to a motherless home and adopt children. They, they have not adopted. They are both in their sisters. So you married. I don't know whether it is contract or whatever it is. But they have no child. Okay. So... Publicly, Adam Soshomole have already announced to the world that the Edo State Governor is childless. Is that not too much to say? Because of politics, it is too much, sir. Maybe we they take all these things small, small. Hmm? He just shown his true self. He thinks highly of himself. This is no good, though. This is not good. This talk is too much. Mm -mm. This kind of thing not be waiting you to take. Eh? The love person. One of the greatest insults for a woman. This should not come from the mouth of anyone. 
let alone a man who cares, who calls himself a leader. This is really below the bet. The fact that politicians are, you know, uh, stooping to the level of insulting each other over personal matters, such as being barren or not having a, a, a spa, is deeply troubling. It shows that they have little of substance to offer and are resorting to petty attacks instead of meaningful dialogue. This behavior is a clear disappointment, especially at this stage in our democracy. Instead of addressing the real issues, they are engaging in disrespectful whatever, which only serves to undermine their credibility and distract from, distract from the pressing concern of the public. This kind of conduct should be condemned and brought to the forefront for serious discussion. Enough is enough. This is really terrible and disappoint and disappointed. Disappointment, I mean to say, to adult people. Oshomole shouldn't have said this because this is absolutely, in fact, it's beyond politics. Like as I said, you don't burn your own. What about your children when you don't burn? Do you know their future tomorrow? That is why it is very, very unwise. For you to just carry them out, they talk whatever you like. Because you don't know tomorrow. You get, you don't know tomorrow. You don't know tomorrow at all. This is not good though. I beg, make a drop out for you. Kindly drop your comment below the comment section. Don't forget to give us a thumbs up. Thank you and bye for now.